What is that sound that I'm hearing? Where is Carlos? I am not feeling comfortable at all. What was that? Is there something else here on the body, maybe? Maybe I gotta touch that thing. And I don't wanna touch that thing, whatever that thing is. A note, of course. Why is there always notes? Easy on vaccine synthesis. Er, uh, easy. <laughs> Essay on vaccine, vaccine synthesis. Uh, on the roles of antigens and adjuvants in vaccine synthesis, Dr. Nathan, uh, Nathaniel Bard, Chief Researcher Spencer Monroe Hospital. To make if, uh, efficiently synth. Uh, no. Yeah, efficiently synthesize to most efficient. <laughs> fuck me. To synthesize a vaccine, both an antigen and an adjuvant are required. The antigen produces an immune response, while the uh, adjuvant increases the efforts of such responses, leading to increased antibody production. Uh, by combining samples of these two ingredients, one can create a potent vaccine base. By processing this vaccine, both with our whatever, both with our equipment, a large batch of vaccine can be created with an astonishing with astonishing ease. What's more, my latest antigen and adjuvant samples yield unprecedented rates of antibody production, producing more than a thousand times the yield of traditional materials. This not only makes it effective vaccine, but also a potential way to eliminate existing infections. Oh. Awesome. To begin vaccine synthesis, place the materials in the chamber. Yes. Synthesis? I have to make it myself? Alright, gotta figure this out. Joe, we're always on our own. Oh. Override key successfully generated. What have we here? Override key removed. What the hell is this for? Okay. It can... Maybe I can use it in those, uh... Thingies that like that door. Guess I can try. Oh, yeah, override complete. Can, can I have my, my sticky, my stick thing back? No? Oh, okay. Oh! <laughs> You're a dick, Mr. Zombie. Oh! No. Yeah, I didn't think so. No. Is that from? Where is it coming from? Oh, there you are. 
Oh, there you guys are. What is wrong with them? Get away. Go away. Okay, these zombies are just tad too freaky for me. Oh, I hear you coming. I'm. Oi! Where'd you come from? How are you so fast compared to your brethren? Get off of me. Just die. Stay on the ground. Stay on the ground. fast. He, he literally came so fast. Huh. <laughs> Sorry. You know what? I have two... I have two large thingies of gunpowder. I'm going to make me some Shotgun shells. Er, not. I meant high grade. I mean, I killed a fuck ton of naked zombies, but that wasn't worth anything. That's just weird. Like, those naked zombies take a shit ton of bullets. type of person I'll just walk up and shoot somebody in the face apparently. <laughs> Weaponry authorized request. Doctor, uh, dear Dr. Emerson, I would like to formally request that the weaponry normally reserved at the, or for the bioweapon synthesis, synthesis team be made available for any employees interfacing with the emission and dismissal of test subjects. These test subjects do not present the same levels of danger as our bioweapon products, but I believe that this weaponry authori authorization is advisable as outlined below. Recently, some of the test subjects have developed new mutation granting them very high regrowth abilities. Is that what the fucking things that I've been shooting are? Our team refers to these specimens as paleheads. They have been appearing with regularity, but the specific case or specific cause has not yet been determined. The astonishing rate at which these pale heads regenerate makes it difficult to deliver a lethal blow with standard weaponry. In any sort of system failure were to occur with within our facility, we would be woefully unprepared or underprepared to defend ourselves. Um, for this reason, I would like to request that high powered weaponry capable of subduing the pale heads be issued to all of the employees working in the shipping and processing. This will ensure that in the event of an emergency we'll be able to quickly eliminate the threat and evacuate safely. Thank you very much for your consideration. Shipping and processing manager Gabrielle Reed. So are the uh, I'm confused. Are the pale heads I okay. <laughs> are the pale heads the things I've been messing with? Oh goodness what is this? Because them fuckers are really hard to kill. Culture sample? Uh, an antigen sample. I'll definitely need this for the vaccine. What in the fuck? Oh, 
Okay, it's just a, a little guy. Is that seriously all that's in here? Just a little Mr. Bobble? <laughs> okay. Did I miss a door? I must have. Okay. What the shit? You know what? I'm here. Oh, God! Ow! That's gotta be one of those, like, pale head things. I'm just gonna shoot it, see how the magnum deals, you know, with this. Oh god, if I would not miss with the magnum, that'd be freaking amazing. Is it still alive or dead? Nope, that bitch is dead. Deader than dead. Oh, I did, I missed the door right there. Shit, man, they bite hard. But I'm not gonna waste my... Uh... Whatever on them. I can't even think. What the hell am I trying to say? My... Magnum rounds! I'm not wasting my magnum rounds on them. There we go. I got that culture sample, so I'm saving. And that Mr. Charlie Bubble dude. Anyway, so, whoopsies. How you guys been? What have you guys been up to in quarantine? Don't we just love quarantine? Having nothing to do. Probably bored out of our minds. I hope all is well with you guys. I hope you guys are staying safe, most of all. That's the important thing, and I hope your families are safe as well. It's, it sucks when you feel like you can't do anything to, to protect them or to stop something like this from happening. This you kind of just feel powerless. What the fuck, zombie? Come on! Don't you wanna get up and get in my place? No idea what he was doing. I just want you guys to stay safe because that's literally the most important thing. I mean if I applaud those who who, you know, have to go to work and I feel, I do feel bad for those that have to go to work, you know, I wish you guys could stay home and be safe, but, I don't know, I guess there are companies out there that feel, how was she able to do that? There are, anyway, there are companies out there that feel, oh my god, that, oh shit. Anyway, there are companies out there that feel that being at work is more important than, you know, trying to stay safe. I am not prepared for this. Jesus. Fuck is that? this where they're made? What the hell are those things? Those are, are those a Oh, those are tyrants. Dude. Look at that. That's crazy. I hope I don't have to fight those things. Bad 
feeling. Bad feelings, Scoobs. Dude, Nikolai is just killing everybody. He doesn't give a shit. Scared me. Oh no. No! Fucking pale face bitch. Get off of me. If you get up from that, I swear to fucking god. <laughs> I hate them fuckers. They bite so goddamn hard. It's unbelievable. Like nasty little bitches. That's what they are. once more and be okay. I mean, not that I want to- what in the shit? Oh, goodness. Wait! <gasps> you know, nobody else got up. to increase immune system response. Uh, expression of concern. Oh my god, it's so long. Senior fellow Dr. Frankel? Okay, is that anything like Dr. Jekyll? Dr. Frankel? Um, please allow me to send my heartfelt congratulations to you and your colleagues at Umbrella Europe for completing Nemesis, a truly remarkable achievement in the field of bioweapons research. Uh, introducing a parasitic organism to a tyrant's brain to gain external control of it? How can I not marvel at such a wild idea? So is Nemesis... I never, yeah, I never really understood that, like how he was able to, like, keep some intelligence. Does that mean that he also, like, uh, from Resident Evil 4, the parasite plaga things, was he infected with one of those? Is that what, does that, what that, is that what that means? I'm, I'm assuming. However, from a medical perspective, I must in, uh, emphatically state my disapproval of this shift away from established umbrella policy. By turning to the use of parasites, you are uh, setting a dangerous uh, precedent. Viruses can be kept in check. I believe an effective vaccine can be developed for any virus on Earth, with abundant funding and a bounty of samples, of course. Can you say the same for parasites, however? Doctors have tried in vain to develop a vaccine for malaria, parasites like, uh, plasmodium. Did I say that right? Plasmodium? Yeah. Are far more genetically complex than the T-virus, and to think they will submit to control and utter folly is, art, is utter folly. Perhaps in your country, consumers will are willing to buy automobiles with no brakes, but here in America, they know better. That is fucking rude. Dickhead. Then again, I recall you have a degree in economics, so no doubt you've already devised a brilliant marketing strategy to win over the naysayers. I look forward to your talk at the forum in Berlin next month. In the meantime, I shall be exploring a medical uh, exploring medical solutions to the to this linguistic problem you voiced on us. Sincerely, Nathaniel Bard, PhD. Nemesis. 
You know, Mr. Nathaniel, you sound like an asshole. Like a serious, uh, I have a feeling. I have a feeling. And I don't like the feeling I'm getting. I really don't. I knew it! Oh, fuck me. Ow, okay. You nasty lizard bastard. Fuck off! God damn, Hunter. Woo! Wait, what? Oh, shit. More? Oh, please! Oh, no! Don't like it when my gut feelings. <laughs> Don't like it when the gut feeling is always right. <laughs> I'm glad I survived that. What's gonna jump out at me now? Oh, is there something up here? Oh! Oh, if only I had these still. <laughs> If only I would have found those sooner. Man, no more than fuckers better fall. Like seriously, just piss off. I can beat the game. <laughs> no ducking. Duck, 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 duck. I know it's stressful being a kitty cat. Life is just so hard. Don't help. Unauthorized materials detected. Either I've got this wrong or I'm missing a step. Unauthorized materials detected. What? Oh! Okay, I was like, ay, 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 I was scared. I was like, what the fuck is going on? Okay, put this one on high, this one on low. Okay. No, this one needs to stay on low. Shit. Haha. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so I had it backwards. Yes. 
Analysis complete. Please remove the vaccine canister. It's a pretty purple. Magenta, whatever. Oh no! Good job, Jill. Like, you don't fucking pay attention. Did you really do that? I don't think you would. Oh. Where the fuck am I now? Escape the facility. Easy for you to goddamn say. Oh! Jesus Christ, Nemesis? Wait, how does he know where I'm going before I know where I'm going? Come on now. Oh my god. You're like a clingy boyfriend. Just don't touch. I thought I had to circle. Don't you just hate it like when those people are just like that clingy on you? That's what he feels like. He feels more consistent in this one than he, do he did in the original. It's really annoying. <laughs> he is just fucking annoying. So should I... make more magnum rounds or should I make... I'm making more magnum rounds. Do you think the handgun's gonna be any good? Against enemies? Oh, I was gonna say, I don't think I can combine this, but I tried. See, I don't know what I'm going to pick up and what I'm not going to pick up. So it's like, I don't want to bring too much. Like, is this, is this overkill? Like, I think so. I don't know if I need to pick up something that's going to have two slots, you know? I just, I don't know. Oh, I was going to say, why can't I say, but I can't. Alright. Oh, what's a notice? What's this? Disposal Center. <sighs> Disposal Center protocols that uh, this facility is uh, is to be used for the dissolution and disposal of test subjects used in Nest 2 experiments. The uh, potent solvent used will ensure that any biological matter within the vat, living or dead, is completely dissolved and ready for disposal. Please follow all security protocols when using the disposal center. Always confirm that no employees are in the chamber before beginning the dissolution process. Always use the regulated amount of solvent, regardless of the volume or mass being disposed of. If a test subject reacts violently, do not halt the disposal.